Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you probably can tell down below, I am going to be doing a very quick short video about some of my favorite current moisturizers, facial moisturizers. Now the reason why I'm doing this video is because I got, when I did an unboxing of some of the products that I got from Clinique recently or a little bit of a while ago, um, quite a few amount of young ladies sent me messages saying that, oh, which is your favorite moisturizer? What have you used? What can you recommend? What's more on the budget side? What's more on the high end side? That kind of thing. So I thought that, you know what? Let me just talk about some of my all time favorite moisturizers and what I put on my face before <laughs> I put my makeup on. I have got two that are on the mid range side of things. And then I've got two that are, of course, higher range side of things so we're gonna start with the two mid-range side mm -hmm. the first one is the Elizabeth Arden one this is the eight hour cream skin protectant I will definitely put the price somewhere you know I always put the price I got you girl this is the eight hour skin protect protectant nighttime miracle moisturizer I absolutely love this moisturizer on the inside it's sort of like a peachy almost um, apricotty kind of color it's really really great especially if you're looking for a moisturizer that hydrates and enriches the skin this is really really good especially when it comes to <clears throat> calming your skin and toning it down so if your skin also has like rashes or some sort of irritations this is very very good for that actually the whole elizabeth arden eight hour um range of products is very very good for irritated skin or if you've got skin that's got that's a little bit problematic that whole range is very very good for that this i use at night time of course and what i'll do is i'll take a little bit of it and then rub it between my hands and then rub it on my face and gently rub into my face and then pat 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 it in if you definitely want to try out something that's more in the mid-range definitely hook yourself up with this okay hook yourself up with this hook yourself up with this <laughs> so another one that's really really good that i've repurchased maybe i think last year i purchased it once this is the aven rich compensating cream aven is really really good especially i pulled this one out so that i could just speak to the people who are very very sensitive and especially rather have sensitive skin not very sensitive but we don't care if you're sensitive if you're not that's your that's your deal that's your thing but if you've got sensitive skin especially on your face a vent is very very good because their products are light but they're very very good this one is great especially for the winter time as well it's very rich i love skincare and one thing that I need you to understand is that I switch between my products. So you'll find that sometimes I'm actually using two nighttime moisturizers instead of one because I've got a lot. So at some point, you don't want to end up throwing things away. Well, of course, I also give my friends my things. So, wow, what a side note. I also give my friends some of my things and things like that if I can see that, okay, I haven't been using this as much and I think it'll have like a better home, then I'll give my friends or whatever. But I tend to use two nighttime moisturizers, two daytime moisturizers and alternate between the two. And I absolutely love this one. I think this one is really great because it's very, very nice on the skin. It's a rich uh, compensating cream. So it's rich, it's thick. You can use it at night or daytime. For me, it didn't really bother me at what time of the day I was using it. But I suggest that maybe try it for nighttime. It's really, really good as well. And yeah, it's also around the mid range too, in terms of the products, okay? Price range, good. And then the two high end products that I chose to put up in this video, I've used, I use quite a few. I've used quite a few high end, um, you know moisturizers but the two i chose for this video is this one this is the um they're both from clinique <laughs> get your life but i've been using clinique for years now um the first one is the dramatically different moisturizing gel now the reason why i picked the moisturizing gel over the d dramatically different moisturizer which it looks exactly like this but the contents are a little bit different the color is exactly the same the original dramatically different moisturizer that is something that my sister uses my sister has very dry skin but i can't talk but i have combination 
normal skin so this seems to work the best for me especially in the warmer months i love using this in the warmer months in the colder months i'll usually switch to the um moisture surge range from clinique but in the summertime i actually really love this one i have had this for maybe going on six months now yeah maybe going on six months now and it's only here so it lasts a really long time like all you need is just like one two pumps one here one here one here blah, blah, blah and then you just rub it in it's really really good it's not as thick as the original dramatically different so this is good if you've got combination skin so rather get the moisturizing gel but talk to someone from clinic about it your skin type and then they'll recommend something for you this over the last couple of weeks i have been using i did get gifted some products from clinique and this was one of them and the first thing i was like mm, hydro blur moisturizer well that's nice that's probably something that i would use during the day or in the morning before i apply my makeup and oh, bye it literally covers up all those marks i've got smile lines for days like at the end of every day i'm usually so upset because my smile lines are showing me flames um but ever since using this one it really has reduced the smile lines i think because of the blurring properties of this moisturizer it's really really great oh it's like a baby pink color on the inside it's really really great because what it does is it blurs out fine lines and wrinkles and fills up those pores so when you come through with your makeup i can't talk today i don't know what's wrong with me but when you come through with your makeup after having applied this your makeup sits really really well and it mattifies your skin as well so it doesn't really give your skin a shine and i love this i think it's a great start before you apply your makeup it's a perfect moisturizer to use especially if you are somebody who's looking to buy or to get yourself a new moisturizer absolutely love this my sister's is over there and in fact i want to show you that we both use it <laughs> to show you that we both use it this is mine and this is my sister's and hers is pretty much wow yeah it's pretty much almost done we both use it and we absolutely love it this is a really really great product if you're looking to buy a new moisturizer that is it from me i told you i wanted this video to be really really short and it is i hope you enjoyed this video if you would like to know anything more about the moisturizers that i use or if you want to recommend something oh before i do that um clarence also has really great uh, oh my gosh, it's got really really great moisturizers as well So if you're just looking and if you've got sensitive skin Clarence is really good as well So yeah, that is it from me and I will see you sometime very very soon um, Until then don't forget to click subscribe Like comment. Let's talk. I will see you in the next video <laughs>